Hi there, Nick Jacoby here, back for our Friday tip. As we discussed last week, we work on our grip. Now, today we're gonna to discuss aim. Aim is a very hard thing to get right. I struggle with it myself. If you aim in incorrectly, you're probably gonna make a flaw or a compensation somewhere in your swing to make up for the poor aim. So, today I wanna to challenge you to practice correct aim, especially on the driving range. Quick little easy way to practice the correct aim. I've got a shaft, you can use a golf club, alignment rod, whatever it may be, a couple feet ahead of my golf ball in direct alignment with my target. My target is the bullseye that is out there. Shaft is, like I said, two to three feet ahead of me, directly in line with it. As I walk up, I get my club face aimed to the best of my ability at the shaft, then set my body parallel with it, and then I'm gonna pull the trigger. Now, when you're on the golf course and you can't have that shaft or alignment rod out there, I challenge everyone to pick an intermediate target. If you watch the best players in the world, watch their eyes, pick out something that's a couple feet in front of you. It's a lot easier to aim at something that's a couple feet in front of you rather than something that is a hundred so yards ahead of you. So pick out an intermediate target. So for this particular shot, I would look at this old divot right here. So I would stare at that divot. I would do my best to line up at it. Once I'm ready, boom, take a look, pull the trigger. Aim seems, seems very simple. However, if you mess it up, it's gonna mess up your golf swing. So practice correctly your aim, you will shoot lower scores. Thanks again for watching. Please uh, hit subscribe to see future videos. Next week, we're gonna add another pre-shot fundamental we're going to talk ball position next week. So next Friday, stay tuned, ball position. Thanks for watching, jacobygolf.com. Come see us here at Stonebridge Golf Club. See you next Friday.